just wanted to give you a real quick update before we have our next campus meeting so that there is no confusion of what's going on. Uh, as we've said before, you know, we've all been moving forward, but the target continues to move. Well, again, it has moved again. And I also believe that I've said before, just because the main campus does something, we may do something a little different. And that has happened also. So as you all know, Morgantown has changed the way they are going to progressively move into their campus. But WVU Tech, along with Potomac State, will continue in what we had already planned. So I wanted to just give you a full, a few bulletins so you remember what we're doing, and then we'll talk about when we're gonna have the campus meeting again so we can answer your questions. One of the questions I'm sure we're gonna get is why. Why is, is tech not moving the same as Morgantown? Well, first of all, we have such a small group of students, it would be impossible for us to do it how they're doing. We have to remember that Morgantown is bringing all their freshmen, all their grad students back to campus for in-seat uh, instruction as much as humanly possible. But they're also making exceptions for the professional schools. So the law school, the med school, and the nursing students will be there for many of their in-seat experiences. They also will have the engineering school, the agriculture school, the creative arts school, the school where they we have majors in physics, biology and chemistry, where all of those programs have many classes that will need to be taught in person for them to be effective and to meet their accreditations. So with that being said, they will have many, many more. Very well could have seven to eight times as many students on their campus as we will. So we are, will continue to move forward as we had planned. I'd like to give you just a few of the things to make sure you remember. Our first day of classes will still be August the 19th. You will still have to sign up on August the 3rd, starting on August the 3rd, to be tested. Every student, staff, and faculty member must be tested before we start classes. The testing will be the 11th through the 13th, which we will talk about in much more detail at our next campus meeting. And then you'll have the online module or the also you will be required for everyone. Masks, social distancing will continue to be required. And move-in that's being scheduled into the dorms will stay the same. The academic calendar will stay the same as we have had it all along. And what that really means is that we will have the week after Thanksgiving, where Morgantown now, because they're coming in a week later, will have to use that as instruction, we will still have the option of using that as either instructional time or review time. So again, all of our safety measures will stay in place. You still will be working with your supervisor to make sure that you know when you're supposed to be on campus, and that will be done with your supervisor and you in a mutual agreement. Our athletic competition will still, at this point, start on September the 5th, and our tuition and fees will stay the same and our room and board because we are using our regular uh, calendar that we had already calculated. We're going to have a campus meeting on Monday at 2 o'clock. You'll be getting an email here in the next day or so. We want you again to send your, in your questions ahead of time. I will have my full staff available. They will be given the questions and they'll be able to answer them within their expertise. Uh, which I thought they did a superb job the last time. So we will have that. And uh, we want to be prepared, but we want you to understand that we are moving forward and look forward to seeing everybody on campus. So campus meeting, Monday, 2 o'clock. Get your questions in. You send it to Tech Relations. That'll be in the email when it's sent out. And uh, I look forward to talking with and seeing all of you real soon on campus. I thank you for giving me the time and I hope all of you have a great day. Thank you.